Hey everybody, Keith Campbell here with Keith and Sheila Realty Group, powered by Fathom Realty. Welcome to our first video on how to hire a real estate agent or a real estate team. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for watching the video. I want to start off by saying this, only hire a agent or a team who is going to be your advocate, that is going to be your fiduciary, who's going to look after your best interests, no matter what no matter the commission split, no matter how much work it's going to take, no matter how many houses they have to show you, whatever the situation, you want somebody who's going to serve your best interest no matter what. Sadly, I wish I could say all real estate professionals or real estate agents do that. Honestly, the majority don't. There are some great agents and teams out there and there are some real slackers. So take your time, interview uh, at least two or three agents or teams and find somebody that's a fit for you actually call references actually call people that have done business with this agent or this team and ask them really good questions like you know how did they communicate uh, how did they respond uh, were they always available did they serve your interest above everything else those kind of questions so why should i choose a team over maybe just an agent well first of all there's all kinds of teams um, there's teams that have two agents, there's teams that have a hundred agents. Uh, it's becoming very popular for agents, especially when they first get their license to work on a team and either be usually be a buyer's representative because it takes a lot more experience and knowledge to be a listing agent. And with the team concept, if it's ran right, if it's communicating well, if it's functional, you'll get a lot of good service. Uh, unfortunately, a lot of them aren't. Now, then there's teams like Sheila and I are a team. Um, however, we're not the type of team where uh, she goes one direction and works a deal. I go another direction and work a deal. We work everything together. Uh, this is December 2020. This year, we're going to close around 35, 36 houses. We've been involved, both of us, on every deal. That's a lot of houses to close basically as one unit. Even though there's two of us, we're working everything together but it also she has strengths i don't have and i have strengths she doesn't have and it makes for a great teamwork where she's strong she works those areas and where i'm strong i take control of so but and there's some great individual agents out there um the only issue there is if they have get sick or they go on vacation or they have a family emergency they're going to hand you off to somebody that you've never even talked to before um, so you got to be careful of all that. You have to be aware of all that and you have to consider all that. So you're looking for a agent or a team who has at least three, four years experience that are selling at least probably six to 50 houses a year. Um, I'm a little weary of teams. I know real estate agents that sell more houses than we do as an individual and they are pretty spread out they are spread pretty thin and i know it's a challenge for them it's probably a challenge for their clients at times so you have to consider all that but you want somebody with experience um we've been full-time real estate agents husband and wife team since day one for over eight years prior to that i was a home inspector i've been a licensed home inspector for 13 years not currently active haven't been in a couple years so we could focus on real estate my wife was a teacher uh, for about 12 years, elementary grade teacher. So she has a teaching aspect to her personality, a nurturing aspect. Uh, I was an entrepreneur before I got into the real estate business. So I've uh, started and sold uh, quite a few companies. Uh, I've shut a couple down. I've learned a lot of lessons, good and bad, but I have an entrepreneurial spirit. So we complement each other really well. So when you're looking at a team, you want that same complementary environment within the team that you hire to represent you to buy the most valuable asset you're probably going to own and let's just be honest most of us our house is the most valuable asset we have so take your time hire the right person or the right team and uh, trust your instincts you're looking for first and foremost uh, somebody who's going to be your advocate serve your best interests be your fiduciary uh, they need to be experienced. They need to have a strong network behind them. So for us, Fathom Realty, we have the best technology on, on the planet when it comes to real estate business. 
Uh, there's a couple other brokerages, very similar to ours, some bigger, some smaller, that use the same, pretty much the same uh, technology we do. Maybe the difference is our back office technology is second to none. So as we start putting a, putting a deal together and put you under contract, we have a back office system called IntelliAgent where I can send all the documents, the appropriate documents to the appropriate party all at one time. And, and you, once you have that link as a buyer, you can go in and check your documents anytime you want. So when I send you documents, I send the listing agent documents, when I send the title company documents, the lender documents, the home warranty company, you're, everybody's pulling from the same source. So there's consistency. Uh, one of the reasons we're with Fathom is first and foremost, the culture. Uh, it's a servanthood culture from the top to the bottom, and we love that. Second is the technology. Our website is linked, uh, is what's called an IDX link. So when you go to our website, website to search homes, you're looking at both the San Antonio MLS and the Central Texas MLS. Um, we can see what you look at. We can see what you like or love. Um, we can communicate through the website that records everything. When I say records it, so if I send you an email, I BCC our website, our, our CRM, and it saves those conversations. So I can go to one place and see everything that we've communicated about, which makes us more efficient, makes us more organized. The other thing you're looking for is when you're hiring an agent or a team is what kind of partnerships do they have? When we partner with a lender, a title company, a home warranty company, uh, a survey company, whoever, um, con subcontractors to do work, they are an extension of us. And we have fired subcontractors. We have fired title companies. We have fired lenders because they didn't meet our expectation and they let us down. More importantly, they let our clients down. So you want to know that whoever you're dealing with, your realtor or realtor team, that they have that partnership that is strong. So let's just take, for example, a lender. You want to use a lender who has in-house uh, processing and underwriting. You don't want them sending out your documents to a third party that they have no control over. Because what happens is when you need an update, it takes forever to get it. When something needs to go back through processing or underwriting, you just get in line like everybody else versus the people we deal with. I can make a phone call and my lender is going to make sure it gets done or whoever it is we're dealing with, my title company, whatever. So the lenders, you want all in-house processing and underwriting. You don't want any ridiculous origination uh, fees or any fees that are excessive. Look, they need to make money. They're in business to make money. We want them to make money, but we don't want our clients to overpay you. So we monitor all those things. Other than that, you just want somebody who's going to be responsive, who has a really good knowledge in how to negotiate. Because negotiation, uh, a lot of times getting a deal done is thinking outside the box. It's not just doing the routine, uh, fill out a contract, send it in, and come to an agreement. Because a little little obstacles come along the way, both in the, in the original negotiating process and as you're going through the closing process from dealing with lenders and title companies and, and home inspections and stuff like that. So we believe we have a lot of knowledge. We believe we have a lot of experience. Um, we're a high producing agent, a team, husband and wife team. I think we're in the top two or three in our entire market for uh, Fathom Realty out of you know, hundreds of agents. So we, um, we look at when we're dealing with a client, when we're serving a client, it's just like we're serving somebody in our family. A, a parent, a child, cousin, a sibling, whatever. So that's what you want to look for. We're, we're, we may not be a perfect fit for you, but they're out there. You just got to do your homework and do your due diligence and find them. Um, what else would you want to look for in a buyer's agent You want, when you're hiring a buyer's agent or a team? Uh, you want to make sure that uh, they have the resources behind them to handle any obstacles that come up, whether that's legal interpretations, whether that's compliance with state guidelines and laws, you you have to be careful because there's some uh, single shingle, as we call them brokers out there that uh, probably mean well, but they don't have the resources to really uh, deal with uh, something that goes sideways. 
All kinds of things happen when you're in the process of buying a house. People die, people get sick with COVID. They could go into the hospital for months, be unable to sign documents. You need to have resources within the brokerage uh, that your agent is sponsored through to, to help get things done. So hope this answers some questions. Uh, we've been going for uh, about 11 minutes, so I'm gonna cut it off here. Uh, but if you have any questions at all, you can call or text me at 830-837-1071. Check out our website at www.keithandsheila.com, K-E-I-T-H-A-N-D-S-H-E-I-L-A.com. And you can search for homes there. You can, there is a ton of information there. Just click on those tabs up front. You can search by communities. You can look at all the buyer stuff, all the seller stuff. You can look at our blogs, our videos. It's all right there. Hope you have an awesome and blessed day. We'll talk to you real soon. Take care.